What's up guys? Welcome to Kid Toy TV channel. For whoever new to my channel, hit the subscribe button to follow more video. Today we're going to go to detail on the hydraulic system work and take a look inside of, of this RC excavator hydraulic. Uh, let's see how the system work. Alright, let's open it up. You can see this is what I'm using with the battery 7.4 battery 4000 mAh it's very small right just fit right in and will last you a while All right. and of course it's running with um, ESC 20A I got a few ESC in there I got one long ESC right under here we got duct tape it. Hang on. Duct tape it up in there. Pretty good. Anyway, so that's the ESC for the uh, motor pump right here. Again, motor pump and the um, and the, the oil tank attach each other. Two in one. P pretty good. Let's see the motor pump in there. This is the motor pump right in there. See that it fit right in there. I'm sure you can see it. There you go. There you go. That's the motor pump and the oil tank. And of course, you know, running by ESC right here. For this servo right here is no need ESC, just, just directly plug in to a receiver. So I got this one is a 10 channel receiver. There you go. That's a 10 channel receiver. You know, when you use radio transmitter, Fly Sky is pretty awesome because I don't know about you guys, but it seems to work pretty good for me. So, for the gear tracks right here and over here, two of them is a control by 28 ESC. I type it, type it in, close it in there pretty good right here so I have two of that and then one this ESC right here is uh, for rotation for the rotation so I got one two three and then four for the and then just three more servo right here so we have total of seven channel on this RC excavator for this fans this one right here this one right here just making the stuff inside core we don't do anything case go direct line to the power all right for the vial the vial three-way vial controlled by three servo so one two three channel so every time when you when you control when you use the when you have the channel to control so when you move the servo we release the oil to pump this pump right right in there the pump we pump right into the vial and then the vial pump the oil right into the cylinder so that's that's how the the, um, the pump move and always anyway. And for the um, the ESC switch, always lack. Use some kind of super glue or something to lack the switch, so that you don't you don't get um switch off, and then try to figure it out which one that is off, and you know it's got it will be a pain. All right, let's put it back in and see how it work. For this, always turn on the radio transmitter on first before turn on the excavator. 
There you go. This switch right here, turn on the motor pump. There you go. All right, guys, that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching and always supporting my channel. And I'll see you guys next time on the next video.